Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of Fish Keep in Jamaica. Welcome to my channel. So a few days ago, I shared with you how I go about breeding live bears. I shared with you uh, this particular uh, live bearing fish, uh, a molly, a black uh, molly, normal molly, that I had within my system. I shared with you that I actually placed it into a, a space by itself so that I can actually observe to see when um, babies are actually um, being birthed. Okay, a few days after that video, I saw some fries. And, um, you know, I got about probably about 15 fries from this fish. Now, the fries were born uh, probably about uh, half up. I don't know how the bonds are small. Um, I don't know how the bonds are large, but it's about probably a little shy away from half inch in length right so it was looking fat i thought that i was gonna get about probably about uh 30 40 small molly um but i got about 14 and they look really good in size so i placed them in one of my gold tubs around the back and uh this is you know just a moment in which i thought that i should share with you okay so i got some babies from a female black molly and so as not to stress her by keeping her in a small container because this is what she actually gave me the uh, 14 fries out of I mean in right so she wasn't in that right so I am actually placing her in a larger container and I'll be placing the fries into a container like this and they will grow out as soon as they reach about probably about a, a inch uh, they're about i place them with the big wigs in other aquarium uh, in other pond space should i say so it's not it'll be like probably for the next 30 days and then i'll check up on her again to see if she give me any more fries i try not to actually um try to breed uh, get uh, one live bear to give me too much babies because after a few go at it um, the, the female actually gets stressed all right so some amount of re resting is required and this resting goes in in line with like um, I would keep the the females in a separate space than the males and then now um after a while i'll actually place them back together when which they'll do their thing and i'll get babies for the next probably two or so months then i'll rest them again and sometimes i even retire them after giving me babies for a while breeding live beer is not necessarily as easy as some persons may think you know baby pop out and all that and getting all those fries you have to be looking at a live bearer once you know that the, the live bearer is about to give birth so it will stay here for a bit i'll keep this orange molly I'll keep this orange one in a small container i don't know the reason why i'm wondering if it's a male if it's a male it has a huge tummy um it's been in here for about two months now and i haven't gotten any fries i think i got fries from an orange molly already but i don't think i got one from this one i think this is a, a female this is a female this is a female right but i um try my very best starts to get my stock up you will be looking so nice having orange and black mollies in an aquarium with probably with a, a white background or even a blue background right okay